made this video. Tonight we maybe go sit wait video. <laughs> Alright, shaking. So for this video, what we're doing is we're going to paint our pots. Um, so we're gonna get we have ceramic pots. Exactly. She's gonna do a bigger one. I'm doing a smaller one. Um, I'm picking, of course, yellow um, because it works with kind of that peachy red orange thing that's been going on in my um, yard and in my house. Um, and I, in my natural tendency to overcomplicate things, have picked three colors. <laughs> um, but they're, they at least go together. Yes. Okay. I've got. What is it? Oh, and so we are using patio paint. It's meant for terracotta pots. Honestly, I think if we used acrylic, it would be fine. But these are well, going to be at least supposed to be allowed to be outside. Yeah, where, like, acrylic would we'd have to keep them inside. Right. So it's going to be a little more resistant to the elements, if you will. So I'm using blue Bahama in patio paint outdoor, citrus green in patio paint outdoor, and cloud white in patio paint outdoor. And I am using sunshine yellow. And of course, she's welcome to use mine if she feels like. So this project is pretty simple. We're just gonna paint, oh God. Um, and Hard then time. we're gonna kind of do uh, take these foam brushes and kind of, you know, we can make some like rustic textures with them. Um, and then at the end, we have twine to wrap around it. So Sierra can play drums, and we can paint. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready? Okay, we're ready. I'm gonna start with white. Oh man, we have to open these things. And I'm just gonna take the top. This is too complicated. Court, we quit. <laughs> we quit. Oh, I'm gonna take the, I'm probably taking the top off. Mobbing it. And I'm just gonna like, because I feel like I'm this gonna need a decent amount. We had a conversation in the car about um, our favorite people to follow on Snapchat. Oh. And I was saying how I'm obsessed with um, Kate Hudson. And Sierra was like going on about the Kardashians and Bella Thorne. Yeah. But like, I, wait, you said there was like five people, and I was, I can't remember. Five people? Mm. Yeah. I'm trying to think. I'm like about to break out my phone. I know I follow Kylie Jenner, and she's pretty interesting. Um, and I follow Bella Thorne. Well, I did. Actually, I stopped following her because her snaps were so interesting. I would go on Snapchat just to watch her. And so wait, why then why do you stop? Because you were because, taking too much time? Yeah, because I, okay, I, I left Facebook in an attempt to be less on my phone and like less in technology, I guess. And then I like just overcompensated by being on Snapchat all the time. So I unfollowed her so I wouldn't have like a reason to always be on Snapchat. But of course it didn't really make a difference. Yeah. <laughs> Who else do I follow? Um, I follow some YouTubers actually. Hello, the DeFranco fam. They're cute. Lynn's awesome person from what I see on the YouTubes. <laughs> You're like based on what I can see on their Snapchat. <laughs> they are amazing people. Let me just tell you more. Um, who else do I follow? Um, okay, man. But I was watched, there was this article about like 56 celebrities you're supposed to, or that you should you should be following. And I was like, holy shit, that's like a lot of that's people. A lot of people. I barely can check in with like the people that I follow now, and they're like all my friends. Right? Like, uh, ain't nobody got time for that. I mean, I do, I like, I'm obsessed with Kate Hudson's though, because she's like, first of all, she's super freaking adorable. Mm -hmm. But she also like, Posts a ton of like workout and like health stuff that she does, but in, but in a way that it's like this is just my life, but yet you kind of like want her life, so you're like, <laughs> oh, I should do that. And then she makes Pilates look like you, like a kindergartner could do it, and you're like, and I really suck at life. <laughs> That's thanks, Kate Hudson. <laughs> but you keep watching, you keep watching. No, totally, totally, totally. I'm trying to think, I just can't, I, cu I just couldn't watch the Kardashians. I feel like. And my brain would completely go to mush. I'm so addicted. She okay. Honestly, I'm. I don't even watch them that much. Like sometimes when it's on, I'll, I'll like check it out. But it's just interesting to see how different another person's life can be. That's what I find interesting totally. about it. She just lives such a different lifestyle than I do. And I well, find duh. that's you that's do what not I, make millions of dollars by doing absolutely nothing. Well, right. And it's just interesting that she doesn't actually just sit around all day. You know, she she does stuff with her time. She does stuff with her she's time. Like a, she's like a hell entrepreneur. I actually have a bit of respect for her, to be honest. She's like an entrepreneur. She's like, in her full, 
the thing about them is that they're like oh that noise they've like mad marketed their lives and like I mean respect they're great business people like you know you can't Last time I liked yours better. <laughs> my, but yours is like my colors. This is like me trying to be. <laughs> Go on a theme. Yeah. And it dry, the paint dries pretty quick. It does so it, dry super quick. So you can get like the cool kind of texture layerings going on. I know I'm thinking of maybe stealing some of your green in a bit to like. Give it a little texture. Yeah. I really like, so I did the white first and I like the kind of texture. I like it. On. A yeah. lot, actually. Less is more. Lesson learned. The other thing I think is crazy is that Selena Gomez finally, like, overcame Taylor Swift's, Ooh, like, yeah, I thing. heard about that. But, like, it's so, like, people are like, oh, Taylor doesn't care. And I'm like, she totally cares because since that happened, she went from posting, like, once in a while to, like, nonstop. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, you know what? Like, I don't think she, it's against Selena. Like, I don't think she's like, oh, I have to be, like... I like you know, like I don't. The very like, best. Yeah, I feel like it's not that like she's against her because they're, they're friends. Totally friends. Yeah, and I would never like. And she yeah, it's not like she's mean spirited. It's just right. like she's just trying to. She's that's just that's like, just oh, the business. Oh shoot! I let in. myself slip. Like yeah, that's just a part of her business. Someone's know? doing it better than me. Like I gotta get. Yeah, she's gotta be number one, dude. And she, props. She's like but such it's not a power even, It may not even be Selena. It could be like you know what? I can't let other people get ahead of me. So like. Right. The fact that Selena, like, right. surpassed me means that, like, there's a big potential for, like, others to, like... Yeah, yeah. I'm so jealous. Like, mine's so ugly and yellow and flat, and hers is, like, this beautiful, like, ocean. <laughs> oh, that turned out really good. It turned out really good. Well, it's me. I got ADD, like, mm -hmm. staring at your pot, getting super <laughs> jealous. And pot jealous. <laughs> and that didn't sound... <laughs> You want to rephrase? Yeah. I'm terracotta pot jealous. There you go, terracotta. But you know what else is a cool thing? Your this pot. This fucking pot. So good. I didn't realize like you were using this brush the entire time. Which one? Oh, you were using that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Which is totally fine because yeah, yeah, like yeah. for what I was doing, I was it doing one well. color. Yeah. Yeah. See. Jealous, ugly yellow green thing. <laughs> I'm gonna make it work, but I am super jealous. So in order to get the the twine on, um, normally you would use gluten and tack it down. But I'm just I did it with paint, and I'm just gonna let it dry for a little bit, and that should do it. Um, and then I'm gonna wrap this, pull it tight. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our pots inside and let them dry. And then after the 72 hours, then you can pot it with a plant. Because then that way you can water it and no one, nothing starts running off. Exactly. Nothing starts Nothings. running off. <laughs> Nothings. <laughs> A.K.A. the pain. <laughs> or in my case, my twine. <laughs> It's not only bigger. Actually, outside of my yellow inside, they're not too far off. Like, granted, my mine is copycat. <laughs> super envious of it. But like, mine is definitely more yellow. And then my since my plate's green, when you put it in it, it has that green cast. I'm like, it's not bad. I like yours. Stop like hating on your pot. It's adorable. But mine was. You know what it worse. is. Because, like, when I put the white on the green, it looks yellow. So they're similar. 
Um, I'm happy because when I started, I really hated my pot. Um, and now I don't mind it. I think I will add a boat eventually. Um, I think it's time for a dance party. So we can go home. <laughs> Thanks for joining us for our caffeine, caffeine and, and wine. coffee. Hey, caffeine and no, wine. No, caffeine, <laughs> caffeine and coffee. And coffee. Caffeine, coffee. Caffeine, and caffeine and coffee. Caffeine and wine. Caffeine and crafts. Hope you enjoyed making your terracotta pot um, not ugly um, and Remember. super cute with a bow. <laughs> or not a bow because you can't tie one. That's totally fair. And you know what? Not everyone knows how to tie bows. Just remember, art is interpretive, and beauty is objective. Wait, no, that's not what I was trying to say. <laughs> Relative. Yes. Beauty in the eye of the beholder. That's you know one way you could say it. Yeah, that I think that's what I was going for. I feel like it was. <laughs>